So today in STEM, we are focusing on coding, and we try to do something different every week for the kids. Um, we've done some big bridge building activities, and we've done um, some different team building activities, and today we're focusing on coding. So we're going to have the kids log into um, one of the applications online in the computer lab, and they just kind of have their own choice. They can make a, lo a Google logo. There are different games they can play. Um, and just different type of activities for anybody's preference. So far, my favorite part is just having the kids be able to get out of their comfort zone. There's a lot of out-of-the-box thinking. Um, they get to be creative, and they don't have to be still. That was my biggest thing for starting a STEM program here at South Green with Miss Holmes and Miss McCausland, who helps out. And we just wanted the kids to have some time where they could focus on doing some hands-on, working with their peers, and not having to just um, sit at a desk and, and do paper and pen all day long. When you offer an after school program, you don't get one type of, of student or child. Um, you get kids from all different areas and backgrounds and so that has, it's been challenging but it's also been very rewarding because some kids have had opportunities that they wouldn't normally have. I get to compete with other people and I get to build stuff. It's fun because we get to do more creative things and um, get to know people more. I really like the experiments and the paper airplanes. It's something new I haven't tried. We try to build a bridge with like a bunch of like stuff that honestly was like it was like paper and like spaghetti noodles and that was fun. Uh, we build um, some chains and bridges. We've built bridges um, and today we're doing coding. You get to try to figure out clues and stuff, and then you get to um, level up to it. When I get older, I kind of want to like make a YouTube account. It's going to be like, if I make it here, and I'm going to like inspire me to make it when I get older. Some of the other projects that we have are, um, we have some roller coasters that we want to build. We bought some robots. We got some extra funding from a grant, and we were able to buy robots that the kids will be able to code. And we also have solar-powered cars they can build that will race once the weather gets a little bit nicer.